science fans! Well, hello, and thank you so much for joining me once again at Science at Home. This is where we show you how to do science experiments or demonstrations in your homes with things that you probably already have laying around in your kitchen. We're gonna to explore today implosions. Now, you might know what an explosion is from watching them on movies or television, but you might not be as familiar with the concept of an implosion. So an implosion is when something collapses in on itself. And often this happens when the pressure outside of something is greater than the pressure inside of something. What we're gonna do today is create an implosion with an empty soda can. So it's not actually completely empty. What I've done is I've added a little bit of water to the bottom of this can, and then I've placed it over a heat source. Now I'm using this little um, chafing dish burner here, uh, but you can do this on your stovetop or on a barbecue if you wanted to. So what we're gonna need is a dish full of cold water. I have a pie plate here, and you ideally you want the water to be as cold as possible. You may even wanna add some ice cubes to it. Then I'm gonna take my soda can and put just a little bit of water in it and start to boil that water. And then once I've got some steam coming up out of it, then we're ready to go. The process for this is pretty simple. I'm gonna take some tongs and I'm gonna pick up this can and I'm just gonna invert it upside down into the cold water and we're gonna watch what happens. And I am just gonna put on some safety glasses before we do this today. Pick up the can and into the cold water. Boom, and there you go, an implosion. So what caused this amazing demonstration? Well, again, it was an implosion. And that's caused when the pressure outside of an object is higher than the pressure inside of an object. So by adding a little bit of water and boiling that water inside of that pop can, we have heated that air, causing it to expand. The air inside of the pop can now has a lower density. When we invert it into the water, the water actually helps us create an airtight seal. Now we've got atmospheric pressure outside of the can and the cold water rapidly cools the air inside of the can and suddenly we've got this huge pressure differentiation and whoosh, it sucks in on itself, implosion. All right, well, thank you so much for joining me here today for this. This is definitely something that you can do at home with the help of an adult and I would recommend wearing your safety glasses as well. If you'd like to see more of this kind of thing, please uh, head to Real Science Real Fun online at our website, sasksciencecenter.com, and we post new videos every Monday and Wednesday, and we've got a lot of other activities that happen during the week. Thank you so much for joining me today, and have a wonderful day. Thank you, YouTube, for joining us here once again. If you haven't already subscribed to this channel, please do so now. If you like the video, give us a thumbs up, and if you don't mind, hit that little bell icon so that you'll be notified every time we post a new video. Thanks and have a great day.